So, hi guys, Toby here for TP23 Productions. A uh, little introduction, that was of course the Master Farm V for Vendetta. Now, I watched it the other week, um, and I thought I'd do a review about it, never seen it before. Uh, you got Natalie Portman in it, Hugo Weaving as well, um, John Hurt's in it, got Stephen Fry in there uh, as the cast as well. I honestly never seen it before and it was an okay sort of film. Uh, it's quite a politically based film and you've got one guy who doesn't like the regime of the government and how it's ran and so that he wants to take power, he wants to take charge, he wants to make a stand and he wants the people of Great Britain really to make a stand with him and he does it in any sort of way that he can. Uh, quite a powerful film really. And it shows that how one man can take a stand and that other people will follow and uh, there's a scene in the film and he, he, he broadcasts to the people and he says that he wants this to change and he wants the people to help him to make it change a few scenes later you see that everybody is wearing all the same sort of masks and the same sort of outfit as V does and um, yeah it shows that people can take a stand and they can unite in the after just one sort of person takes the stand and he he wants uh, he wants people to believe in him, to follow and to stand up for what they believe in, in the rights and how the government should be run. And it, yeah, it's, it's uh, quite a popular film and it's quite powerful as well. Never seen it before, but it shows how people can unite and how they can be positive. It's a, it's a good film. Um, it, it shows how propaganda can uh, influence people. And how, uh, how it can be a thriller, really. It shows that the British government at the time can be wrong, it can be corrupt for all the wrong reasons, and uh, they do what is they think is right, but it's not. It's what's right for certain people in the government and for certain people in power. That is what it's only good for. The people who that it's actually affecting, it cannot be good for them. So guys, overall, V for Vendetta, pretty powerful film, very politically based, set in England, new revolution in the government power, and one guy doesn't like it, he puts his voice, he puts his opinions out there, and uh, a lot more people stand up for his rights and their rights, and what they all believe in, and it all comes out in the end. Very powerful, very good, very entertaining. Overall, a very worthwhile watching film, really. Probably pick it up for a couple of quid nowadays, but very entertaining. Watch it on telly. Loved every minute of it. Very entertaining. Uh, so, yeah, that was my two part quick review of uh, Viva Vendetta. Hope you enjoyed it. Thanks for watching.